Alright, well, the Bible says forgive. Now, I'm going to forgive at this point. The next time I feel something hit me, give me a fucking headache. I mean, I already have two people calling me back as it is. But on, uh, see, the cybersecurity department of the Justice Department can go back and get every video that was erased off of YouTube. And since on one channel alone, there were 600 and some videos, then there's other channels with probably a couple hundred videos each on them. I'll drop every name, location, place that something happened and if I was at one location and it happened since I was renting then there'll be a lawsuit. I'll contact a private investigation company take a polygraph test to prove that I'm not lying about said incidents. From everything that I have seen, heard, have had stolen, can prove, can swear out an affidavit of truth, and I still have two departments calling me back already because of yesterday and getting pissed off, so, unless people want to be convicted of torture, stalking, harassment, telephone intercepting, wiretapping, torture, and attempted murder. Oh, and let's not forget landlord retaliation. Oh, and, and tax evasion. Because, you know, that contract was kind of broke when, you know, I was told it's best to move after paying a large sum of money and never getting the end product. <coughs> so the next time I hear a click, a pop, a popping, a hit to the heart, I don't care what it is. And I don't care whose name gets thrown out. Being tortured for two years and having to deal with all that bullshit. Stuck with brain trauma. I have to listen to classical music. Just so I don't let my temper get the best of me and, you know, want to just straight sue. Because you know that's what I like to do. Everything from... Stepping on my rights... Depriving me of my rights. To the Fair Housing Act. Stalking. Telephone misuse. Harassment. To being knocked out. There's my siren. Right on time. I don't give a shit. Because I know I can pass a polygraph. Me. Me, the one holding. I know I can pass it. Can everyone else pass it if asked to take one? 
That's the big ass question. I don't want to have to get people in trouble. I said that a long time ago. I don't I don't have to throw somebody out there like I shouldn't have to. But I sure as fuck will because when I pay X amount of money, you can be awarded 10 times the amount. That's just for that one thing. Torture alone? Shit, that's like being injured by a government worker. Or using government equipment to torture? The government is responsible. So, if I were to take an MRI or an EEG for my brain and it not match my original, well, there'd be a little bit of proof there. The fact that I can look at my door handle after I just put it on a month ago, a little bit more proof. The fact that there's a hole in my wall, a little bit more proof. The fact that nobody does anything illegally, those white envelopes fucking differ. See, I thought it was a fluke to only see him in one location, but to see him in multiple locations? Where the fire department show up at your house at 8 o'clock at night in no one else's house? And then back all the way up the street in a private truck. Not, not in a fire truck or anything like that. No, no. Private truck. To break in all four of Maryland's privacy laws, to break in the landlord-tenant law where, you know, some fuckery goes on and a couple hundred to maybe a couple thousand dollars worth of shit and collectibles is thrown out. Or to where I'm made to wait months to move into an apartment that's been illegally wired with shit. Read your Bibles. <laughs>